Hey, how's it going folks? E.T. here with another iMovie tutorial. In today's tutorial, we're going to take a podcast, an audio podcast, and turn it into a video so we can upload it to YouTube or Facebook or wherever you want to upload it to. And this came from a question that somebody asked, how would you do like an album or a podcast with an image? So I'm going to show you how to do that. First thing we're going to do is start a new project. Okay, it'll be a movie. And what I want to do now, and this is kind of to get around some of iMovie's automatic things, is what I want to do is actually add a background here. I'm just going to add a black background. Okay, what this is going to do is hopefully it's going to set this project to be a 1080p, which is 1920 by 1080, normal, normal HD size monitor. If you are importing an image, which I'm getting ready to do, that's a little bit smaller than HD, iMovie's going to kind of assume you want it to be a smaller movie, which we don't want to do. So we're going to do that. So now on the on my desktop here, I have a almost three hour podcast and I have a little image thumbnail from the album art of the podcast. OK, let me go back to my media and I'm going to go ahead and just drag these two in here. So now we have the two pieces of media we need to make this project happen. OK, let me make my screen a little bigger and I'm going to resize some things here. Currently, we have four seconds. Our audio is about almost three hours long. So what you're going to do is kind of click, hold, and drag it down to the bottom audio area here, which is called the audio bed. Let's shrink this up so we can actually see the complete audio file. There we go. OK. Again, this is only four seconds, and we have almost three hours here. What we're going to do is drag this out by left clicking, just holding and dragging it all the way. And I want to go a little bit past just in case. I don't want to cut off any of the audio. So now we have a black background and we have the complete audio file here, the podcast or the album or whatever it is. But we need our image. We want to put an image here. And again, you can put multiple images if you really want to do this. But for this tutorial, let's just go ahead and do one. So I'm going to grab this album art here. I'm going to drag it down to the timeline. And it's really small, so let's uh, make this bigger. Yeah, there we go. So basically, you're gonna have to do the same thing. You're gonna stretch this the length of the audio file. And you'll have to, depending on the length of the audio file, you'll have to mess around with the, the length of the video in the timeline here. Again, this is not affecting the video itself, it's just the presentation of it. So you can actually see the whole thing, or if you need to get closer and look at the detail of the audio. So let's just go ahead and make it as small as possible now. Okay, now I can stretch this all the way to exactly the same length as the black background. I'm going to double click on it to highlight it. I'm going to go to this drop down and go to picture in a picture. And what this is going to allow me to do is actually customize how big the actual image is and the position of the image itself. So let's just put it smack dab in the middle where the crosshair is there, show you where it is. I might go a little bit bigger actually. A little bit bigger and then put it in the middle. How's that? Uh, a little bit smaller. Okay, there we go. That's good enough. Good enough for government. So now we have a video that is about two hours and 49 minutes long. So you'll notice I, I did mention that I wanted you to go a little bit longer, but there's some excess footage here. So from here, what I want you to do is actually slide this slider to the right. And then at the bottom of iTunes, go ahead and grab this little slider. And we're going to go to the end of the movie. And you'll notice the difference in length. So now we can kind of shorten this up a little bit. Just so you can locate the end of that video. Okay. So what we're going to do here is use the cursor to kind of chop it up. I'm still going to leave a little bit extra here, but I'm going to get as close as possible to the end. So now what I want to do is I want to click on the top picture in the picture and then hold shift and click on the bottom as well. And now that both are highlighted, I can actually split both of these. So let's go ahead and right click. We're going to split the clip. So from here, just click and delete each one of those. But you'll notice we still have a little bit extra here. What I want to do is then I'll just left click I'll left click and hold and drag to get closer to where I need to be. And you always want to listen to the end of the video here to make sure you get the whole thing. Because sometimes iMovie thinks it's smart and it chops off a little bit of the end. So let's go ahead and have a quick listen. Yep, that sounds like it's the end. So we'll go ahead and butt it up against that. Now for this video, I'm going to go ahead and fade a little bit at the end. So I'll grab this little controller here and just add a little bit of fade. So in the end, it'll start to fade out. And I'm going to go ahead and go to the beginning of the movie and do the same thing. I'll fade it in. 
So let's scroll all the way to the left. We'll grab this little controller and we'll fade in just a little bit. So right when it starts, we have a nice little fade. We have our almost three hour long video and then it fades out. Okay, so that's it basically. That's how you turn an audio podcast into a video so that you can upload it to YouTube or Facebook or Dailymotion or wherever you want to upload it. Your own server, it doesn't matter. And from here, I would actually just click on the button at the top right. So this is for exporting or sharing. And I'll go to File. I'll change my video to 1080p because most people want a 1080p video on their screen. So we'll go ahead and do that. You can enter a description, a title. Best podcast in the universe. Those of you who know the No Agenda show will know why that is said. Tags. Podcast. Podcasting news commentary funny etc and the reason why i usually enter these tags here because i have a stinky suspicion that youtube google bing all the search engines still kind of look at this metadata this, this information here and possibly use it in the search so i have no way to prove this but i always make sure that i title it and i give a good description and some tags Okay, from there, make sure it's video and audio. Make sure it's 1080p if you, if you can. Uh, quality, I always do high. And the compression, I'll do better quality. Usually, I think about this for video. I want the best quality as possible. But in this situation, the video, I don't care too much about. But I do care about the audio. So I still want the compression to be a, a really good quality. And if you go any higher than, than high here, like ProRes and Custom is just way too big, but High is a very good kind of format just to choose for uploading. Okay, then you hit Next. You pick a location and you wait for it to finish. Okay, well, I think that's about it for today's tutorial. I want to thank everybody for watching and we'll catch you next one. As usual, peace and aloha. Hey.